Retrieving data from phones and hard drives of criminals is now a lot easier for law enforcement all across the Tampa Bay area. News Channel 8's Jamel Lene shows us new crime fighting techniques that analysts are using to help solve these cases. The Pinellas County Sheriff's Office is home to a state-of-the-art forensics lab, first of its kind, not housed on federal property. The Tampa Bay Electronics Crimes Task Force is the 40th task force worldwide, and the headquarters is sitting right here at the Pinellas County Sheriff's Office. The force is comprised of 16 federal, state, and local agencies who conduct digital forensics analysis. These tech experts examine and retrieve data that might be lost or hard to get off electronics such as computers, cell phones, and hard drives. Sheriff says they use the data to help crack criminal cases. As people become more and more sophisticated and technology becomes more, more, more and more sophisticated, as the challenges become greater. And again, getting into these devices and being able to, in, in a uh, very reliable way uh, that meets evidentiary standards and evidentiary collection standards, being able to retrieve this data and preserve it and then put it into a useful format so that it can be used for criminal investigations. The lab was helpful retrieving evidence in the Roberta Cable case. The Clearwater woman who was murdered off State Road 590 last year. Analysts were able to get text messages and photos off her phone that had been sitting in a septic tank for a year. Since the lab has opened in June, they've received about 400 submissions for processing from different law enforcement agencies across the Tampa Bay area. Reporting in Pinellas County, Jamelina News Channel 8.